Here is why you should care about the fighting that is going on in Sudan. What's happening there is more than meets the eye. And it's time for the world to discuss the actual truth of what is going on there. America and Russia are at it again, just as they did 60 years ago during the Cold War, when they fought proxy wars right in Africa, leading to the death of thousands of innocent Africans. They are at it again in Sudan, fighting a proxy war. Let me explain. Two factions of the Sudanese military are fighting each other. One of them is led by Lieutenant General Mohamed Hamdan, head of the paramilitary group known as Rapid Support Forces. The other faction is led by the Sudanese Army Chief, General Abdel Fattah al-Burhan. So why are they fighting? This is where Russia and USA come into the picture. You see, in the last couple of months, Russia has finalized a deal with Sudan to establish Russia's naval base in Sudan's Red Sea coast. America is not too happy with that. Actually, they're furious. America's ambassador to Sudan, John Godfrey, expressly warned Sudan not to seal that deal with Russia. But they're going ahead and doing just that. And so when the paramilitary unit began fighting the other faction of the army, that wasn't happening in a vacuum. The big problem is that you're not going to hear this in the mainstream media. Neither are you going to hear a lot of African governments voicing this which is very unfortunate because Africa must learn to speak its truth and stand on this truth because truth will set you free. So it is left to the African people, we the African people, to speak this truth and tell America and Russia to get off Africa, to get their hands off Africa. The days of the Cold War, the days of the shenanigans of the Cold War are completely over and they cannot fight proxy wars in Africa at the expense of innocent African lives. That has to stop. The fighting in Sudan must stop. The puppet masters must stop their evil, diabolic games.